hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel this is another video i'm showing you of uh, a nissan note e-power so uh the nissan note e-power feels and drives like any electric car because of the way the e-power system operates uh the e-power makes a, a a smooth and comfortable ride and uh, it's important to note that there is no charging port on this car as the battery is replenished by the engine so there is no direct connection between the engine and the wheels like on most uh, parallel hybrid models as it does so um, this one as you uh, push down the throttle it engages uh, to supply more power to the battery so uh, the engine supplies more power to the battery and most of the time you will uh, absolutely hear nothing from the battery which is located under the seats to preserve uh, the cargo space and uh, inside this car it feels spacious despite being a mini car the boot is cleverly designed for maximum space and there's plenty of the leg room in the front and the back the car is a five-seater car and uh, it comes uh, basically the e-power model comes with three modes there is a normal s and the eco in the normal mode the car's regenerative brakes operate with almost the same feel as the traditional car but in the s and eco uh, more or the same they engage at uh, three times the breaking of the cheese force so you can see i've told you the, there is a uh, plenty of space at the front and the back And uh, in this car, you can see that is the boot, I've told you. It's very, very spacious. A very good car. In terms of uh, efficiency. There's only one major drawback of this e-power, which is uh, it still relies on the combustion engine, which results in emissions that must be considered. That is the major drawback of this car. Otherwise, it's uh, a good car. And uh, so I'll show you. In this car, the chassis number is located on the small plaque near the bottom of the windshield on the driver's side. So let me show you. It's located on the near at the bottom of the windshield on the driver's side. You will see the chassis number. There you go. That is uh, the chassis number you are seeing. While uh, the fin plate or rather the name plate is placed in the driver's side door jump and in the firewall of the engine bay, you see there. That is the name plate which basically bears even the engine number and the chassis number. There. That is the fin plate. Well, uh, 
the engine number is located uh, on the engine block the left side of the engine block okay to locate it uh, it's uh, not easy to locate it but there you go you can see that is uh, the engine number on the left side of the engine block there you see it and that is it guys thank you for watching please subscribe like and comment thank you